All right, three hours total. Frankie, we're here late. Yes, we are. Officially. Mm -hmm. We were going to be here two hours ago. I know. I really do blame you. Yeah. Yeah. I sort of do too. Mm -hmm. All right. No, we're actually in overflow parking. Yes. Um, the event itself looks, I don't know, looks kind of busy. We drove down there looking mm -hmm. for a spot. Exactly. And it wasn't there maybe a couple hours ago. What's your EDC? Um, I have the Spyderco Rhino. I have the Spyderco Smock. Yes. It's Spyderco Saturday. Mm hmm this is aftermarket scales. Yeah. This is Kevin Smock. Yeah, yeah. I think scales. he might be here. Yeah. Yeah, we went with Spider Co. Um, uh -huh. Strategically, I guess you could yeah. say. All okay. right. Well, let's get over there. All right. Do it. We've had to walk two and a half miles from the overflow parking. Yes. REC is over this way. Yeah. We can just see uh, tents and different stuff set up. Lots of cars, lots of people. Yeah. It'll be interesting to see what it's like. We don't really know what to expect. Uh huh. I like that Honda. showroom and that's where she's headed checking out some of the pro -techs. we were just talking we used to be more into automatics yeah we're we're just not anymore i remember at one time i really loved the pro tech piranha i love their logo more than anything else yeah it's just really kind of funny but i just love the Spilled coffee. <laughs> I don't yeah. think this floor. I think it'll mop right up. I'm gonna scoot it underneath. I like that. Nobody okay. will know. Besides everybody on the video. Except all 200 people yeah. watching this. Oh, you know what? I saw this online. They have their own editions of the Runt Fives. It's like a woodland material, camo woodland print, which is kind of a neat option. You know what I'm liking there? The Newport Tuxedo. It's 250 yeah. right there. Yeah. That would be one of my choices out of this case. You know what I don't like about this place? What don't you like? It's not made for short people. It's what? Not made for short people. Oh, Frankie's a little shorter. I can't well, see these. I'm a little I taller too, so. I can't see them. Like, look, I have to be on my tippy toes too. We just had a sales associate ask if they could help us with anything. Yeah. They have to open these cases. We can't just open them and check one out for ourselves. I need six inches, please. Frankie needs six inches. But, like, right here, my view, I can't even see the prices. Okay, we all feel sorry for you. Let me know which one. Fine. Look at that. She has to test the Fisher Space Bed. There we are. This place is packed. Look at these custom scales. Scales for what? Um, pair of three, bug out, 940, and PM2. Nice. And Chad, our laser guy, did those. Yeah, okay. they look good. Oh, remember when these watches were like the hottest thing ever? Um, I don't. I was never, I was never into watches. I know, I know. She, she is. This one today. Well, you just gotta see her over the top. You can see her here. Here's all Microtech. Just everything you could possibly imagine from Microtech. Now, what's this one? Okay, so this is the Annex. Yeah. It is 
Chinese made. It's a Riot Microtech. A Riot Microtech? Yes. How well is that going to go over? I don't know. I'm not sure. It looks nice. It is. We know it's Riot, so we know it's going to be nice. Right, exactly. There's uh, the UTX 70. Frankie has a couple of those. UTX 85, that's a his or hers knife. Oh, look, here's that new Ultim yeah. material. I like the Ultim. We're seeing that more and more. I don't like double-edge. No, I'm not really a fan of double-edge anymore either. If you had to choose an 85, which one would you choose? Um, Probably that distressed purple. Yeah, me too, actually. Am I the only one who thinks that that Microtech stitch looks like a gas station knife. No, it does. It does, okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah, look at that. That's beautiful. Right? I'd go for the murdered out, serrated even. Yeah. You get your free raffle ticket from now until two. Okay, raffle You will need to put your name on it. Please be orderly about it. You have two hours to get this done. You'll be good. Raffle will start at 2.30 and you have to be present to win. Another reminder that there's food truck and an ice cream truck out front, so take advantage of that. We got a couple of the bench made cases here. Frankie and I are not seeing the Narrows knife. Maybe we, they have it somewhere else. We just did the video. Yeah. It got a lot of negativity. Yeah, it really did. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I love it still. Yeah. I don't care what people say. No, this is Benchmade. They're saying 20% off all Benchmade. And the prices already look okay. Yeah, like normal retail prices. Yeah, so you can get some deals. So like a blue bug out would be, what is it, 130 That's not too bad. Yeah. Yeah. Did you ever have the Freak, the Mini Freak, right there? No, I have not had the Mini Freak. We had the full-size Freak. That looks like your style of knife. Yeah, I do actually really like it. You've got that right there. Yes. I like it. Then I should get another color of the um, the auto that comes out. Maybe I'll get the blue auto. Is that okay? The blue auto? Here's a Savivi case. We're just taking a look. Shout out to Ben. There's some NAFS models. Hey, Ben. The Lander. Mm -hmm. What else does he have? He has some with just Savivi. Yeah. There's a baby banter and then the full size banter. Yeah. yeah. Oh, and they got some of the scales for him too. He's got all kinds of accessories. He's got swag. Swag? <laughs> What's up top here though? Ricky, can you see? Can no, you see? I cannot. Bird blades. Some good stuff there. I literally cannot really see it. Oh look, Liang Ma. Yep. Shout out to our friend. And Liang. The uh, field duty. I yeah, love that. That's probably my favorite right now of mm -hmm. Liang's designs. Okay, I don't know why we've never got one of these Chavez knives. Maybe because they're kind of in hand, they're very chunky. They're what? Chunky. chunky. They're fat. Yeah. But I do I kind like of the like style. them. Yeah. I think we have a Chavez pen. Yeah, we do. Yeah. Mm -hmm. My pen collection. Frankie is loves pens. The Redencion. Oh, that's right. That's how you have to pronounce it. Redencion. Oh, there's Best Tech. They got all kinds of stuff things. in this case. This is a random case. Uh, let's go to the other side and see what's over there. All right. See, they do have good sales going on. Oh, so if you're not here, we feel bad for you. There is some really good deals going on. Okay, some Savivis. Oh, look, they already have the, the Vision mm -hmm. FG. Oh, I was going to say if they had that cream one, I would get it. That's the one that we had, and Frankie changed it. I did change it, yes. She, um, she dyed it. I dyed it. This is like our collection. Actually, it might be lacking a few. <laughs> we we have a couple Sabibis, don't we? Yeah, a few. If we brought them, if we brought them all here, we would need our own glass case. We should have one of these cases. Yeah. What are the OTFs? Yeah. Cobra Tech. Oh, these are the annoying ones that you hear the whole time through shows. Don't you hear that with all OTFs though? Especially, but these ones even more so. But they're. Yeah. 
some Bella songs. Now you're testing a Bic? They're one of my favorites. The Bic pen? Mm -hmm. What are you doing? I'm drawing a bird. Just randomly. Do you think it will disappear? Let's test it. Check this out. They got a case for Olight. Uh -huh. Clearance. It's marked clearance. No, Olight throwing knives. All right, yeah. It gets you over here, though. Clearance. There's the O bulb. We've got, I don't know, only like 10 of those in the house. I know, I love those things. What was this one? We have one. It's the Javelin, Javelot. Javelot Pro. Uh -huh. That's a thrower. Uh -huh. I love Olight. Oh, we have one of those too, the lanterns, the yeah, O lantern. Yeah. Frankie's been liking the UV lights lately mm -hmm. because she's been painting with what do you neon. what do you call that? Just neon, neon paint? Yeah. 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 It makes it really fun. Really fun. I like those arc felts. We have yet yet to test one. We have one. I know, and we haven't tested it. I know. Let's Olight, actually get it out. <laughs> Olight sent us one. Let's see, do they have these on the other side or is that the throwing knives? No, it's just other random stuff. Oh, the lightning's over here. We have an OTF Lightning, I swear, from like, what, seven or eight years ago? Yeah, that was like one of your first knives because nothing fancy. You said, get this knife. Yeah, maybe it was even longer than that. Yeah. But I swear it was only 20 bucks. Yeah. They doubled in price. It's, they're so expensive at $40. They're probably still an okay deal. Okay, wait a second. Look at this up here. What? Do you see what I see? A pepper spray launcher. Launcher, yeah. just. Just keep that in your front pocket. That is insane. Oh my gosh. Yeah, just keep it around. Ooh, clearance. This is clearance stuff. Guys, I read that you found it for me. Looking at some spider coats. Part of the salt series, or at least one of them is, that's the assist. That might be a contender for the ugliest spider co. I think that's just mean. What what do we have? The battle station? I love the battle station. It's, Don't pick on the battle station. It's nasty. It's terrible. No, well what it's do you not. think of that? What do you think of the assist? I, it has good um personality. It's got personality? Yeah. Yeah. It's not always about looks, it's about the personality. This is one of the spider coat cases. You can find them all throughout this store. Okay, what does the green mean? Does that mean that they're on sale? I'm all about sales. You're talking about those little tags? Yeah. I don't know. We've been here for like half an hour. We need one of these for our knife room. Yeah, we do. Or like 30 of them. <laughs> yeah, we do. <laughs> We're, we're never going to be able to look at everything for one video. Here's your Manix tube. The Manix... Am I going to spoil it though? The Manix 2 Lightweight has got to be my favorite overall Spyderco for years now. Yeah, and I'm still kind of mad at you for not letting me buy the $70 one at Blade Show. At Blade Show? I know, yes. I know. You regret it. I know you do too. Well, we could have turned around and sold it. If nothing else, we could have turned around and sold it for you double that. We missed it when we walked in, but here's some of the uh, the different sales that are going on for today only. Yeah, that's a good deal. Is it the same on the other side? Okay. Today's schedule. It's going till five. Okay. All right, and then there's the checkout right up there. Upstairs, there's like, okay, yeah, it's a lounge, but they've got sharpeners working up there right now. We haven't been up there yet. Check this out. They've got a NAFS and REC. It's the tune-up station. All right. This is custom for this store. That's pretty cool. But they got um, a variety of different sharpeners all set up here. That was a series too. Some different custom work that we're looking at. All kinds of stuff. There's just too much, too much to uh, be able to fit in one video. 
try to talk them every time they listen to your channel. Thanks, you. Thank you so much. <laughs> nice meeting you. We're getting you. noticed nice a couple of times here and there. <laughs> they have a whole wall just for VanQuest, Vertex, bags and cases. I think there's other brands up here too. There's a ton of varieties. Kershaw, CRKT, Demco, and Cold Steel. But look at this. There's even a couple of damned designs. Oh, interesting. Yeah. Huh. At least two of them. Hodge, hodge, all kinds of goodness. Oh, look at that. The drop bear. Yeah. That was one of Kaiser's most popular models yes. as of recently, last couple of years, right? Okay. Why haven't I gotten a mini sheepdog with a button lock yet? Sheepdog, button lock. What the heck? Prices look good. That's so nice. I like the all black one. Yeah. We have one of these Natrix XLs yes. in copper. I, I don't. Hate that. I don't like it. Does anybody want to buy it? I don't like it. I hate that knife, but it's like one of those knives that we just need to have all the time. It's got patina on it. Yeah, it does. I think I liked it before the patina. Yeah. There's a couple of Demcos. I like both of those. Yeah, these are on sale right now. Oh, they had a case yeah. over on the other side that uh, were, were some Demcos, yeah. They're on sale for 120 right oh, now. Oh, right there, there yeah. we go. Not bad. Again, I feel sorry for you if you're not here. I know, you should be here. Lots of, Lots of Kershaw's. Yeah. I'll make my way to the other side. Okay, let's go with it. Some of the launch series. I think they're up to at least 16. We're gonna be showing we're gonna be showing the 16 here soon. 43. I think that's the that's the 15 there. Mm -hmm. The blur. No, you have the live one. No, they don't. Oh, do they? Yeah, they, they do. It's right there. She's talking about the OTF, the live wire. Mm -hmm. It's a Kershaw OTF, that's a first for them. I'm 99.9% .9 sure. Don't look to us for night thoughts. There's the leak. We used to collect a lot more Kershaws. Yeah, we did. They're good. Yeah, they're We have the collection of onions, of course. I think what I don't like as much these days is most Kershaws seem to be assisted. Yes. I like manual true. knives these days. What do you have to say about the iridium, though? The iridium? Yes. Oh, they've got the crossbar, the Duralock, I think is what they call it. Yeah. Yeah. Um, love it. Yeah. Love it. Mm -hmm. We did a video on those earlier this year. A lot of others. It's not just us. They're very popular. I still love the blur. Yeah. Do we have that exact color I think combo? So, yeah. It's great. It's just assisted. I'm just not crazy about it anymore. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I know. Taking a break. We went to get the car. We had cold drinks still. We actually, Frankie, we moved. Yes, we did. We moved to the back of the lot. There's the store inside there. That's my favorite guy right now. That sounds really bad, but he's giving away free coffee. There's I coffee. love him. I'm zooming in. Mm -hmm. There's coffee right there, and you're yeah. saying it's pretty good? Yeah, it is. I actually think he's out of the hot coffee that was free. There was mm. another uh, There was another full case of coffee over there. Yeah, I did drink my fair share of it. All right. Now <laughs> we're just we're just taking a little break. We'll be back in in a second. Yep. The, the drawing for the raffle is in like half an hour. I know. I hope we win. What are we supposed to win? I what have you, what's no idea. The, I don't even know what the prize is. I don't either. But I want to win something. All right, that is going to Mr. Greg Fox. Right now, we haven't won yet. No, we're still losers. All right, next up, same thing. Carbon fiber wallet, key case, and backpack. Thanks to Spiderco. Is going to Amanda Roland. Partially serrated. Uh, these are going to come as 
Spider Go hats as well in a prize pack. Last prize, the Yeti cooler. Check this out. I walked upstairs to get a photo and she won. I won. What brand is that? Vertex. Vertex. Nice. Nice. I don't know the brand that well. I know they're nice. Yep. Who's going to? Austin Koloski. It's not us. It's not me. Was that you or me that won? I won. It was me. Because hey, you have both. He's a viewer. Oh, that was one of our viewers. Yeah. What do you think that sells for? We gotta go look. Nice job. Nice job. It's been a while since we've looked at open L's. Yeah. Just the variety for the brand. I was actually looking at this online. What's this one? It's like a little chef's knife. Isn't that cute? I like the style. Yeah. Le I like, petite. I like the price. 36. Right? I know. What's look, you can put your finger in the hole. You can finger the hole, she says. Alright. It's been a while since we've gotten an open L. What is the what are the basic ones? The folders, what are they selling for these days? Let's see here. 16, 17, 19, and 20. Here, show us one. Here's the 16. You know how to open them. Sorry, I it's forgot. A little slide lock. Yeah. And then you lock him. Okay, still priced pretty well. I think it's gone up since last time we looked. I know. Okay. Oh, there's those oversized. What's this one? What does that set go for? 89? 89, yeah. yeah. It's a Nomad cooking set. Look at that. Oh. <laughs> it's about to fall. What a hurry. Okay, so this one comes with... Oh, it has a cutting board too. Includes cutting board, the cutting board, nice. A peeler, a dish towel, folding bread knife, a combination of corkscrew and knife. Interesting. Oh, I saw this online too. I kind of like this. This would be good for camping. Spoon, fork, and knife. Yeah. That's great. I'm gonna open it up. Open L, open it's it up. Open the open L. Yeah, I'm going to. I just want to see what it looks like. Oh, it is really neat. This is what's catching your eye? Yeah. Okay. Well, remember when we went camping and we didn't have, we forgot our, <laughs> our spoon and fork? Yeah, I remember that trip. Yeah, it was funny. Okay, so then let's see here. Let's see if I can figure it out. Looks like you just put it in like, Oh, I see. You I put see. it in like that. And then you turn it. Ooh. To lock it into place. Okay. Look at that. I like it. That's kind of neat, isn't it? Can't say I've seen one of those before. Let's see if I can figure out how to get it back out. And then they hook together. Okay, that is kind of neat. I like it. Yeah. That's a good size axe for you. 85, 89. That is nice. It's a whole wall of them. <laughs> Looking at the Chris Reeve case, of which there's a few. Yeah, there is a few. Right, but this, this glass case on both sides has, I don't know. It has decent knives in it. 50 different manufacturers? Yeah, it does. There's McNeese. 
the Mach 2 is still one of my all-time favorite knives. Yeah. It just is. Yeah. There's some Barrow knives. We've talked to them in a, a blade show a couple of years ago. Yeah, we got one of these ones. This is American Blade Works? Yes, uh-huh. Yeah. 200 bucks? It's a killer deal. They are USA made, aren't mm -hmm. they? All right, yeah. Okay, the Synapse Mini in the Ultim is a sweet looking knife. What are they selling for? Um, Can't quite see that price. I think it's 360. That's for the big one. Yeah. I don't know how much the Mini is. Maybe two? 55? Nice voice. Yeah, um, that's my guess. Tactile, the same ones that do the pens. Yes. They've got the Tactile Knife Company. I do need that 8-bit one to go with my pen. The 8-bit? Uh -huh. All right, yeah. Here, wait, 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 look. Do you look in my purse? Jeez, look. I got her that one. I've actually been carrying it. She's carried and used it. I have, yes. Oh, there's TRM? Mm-hmm. Yeah. That is interesting. Look at the handle on that one. On the nerd, it's called Cat Eye. Here, actually, let me get over there. Okay. Yep. That's Cat Eye? Yes. I see it. I kind of need that bigger than Cat Eye. Frankie has a couple of cats. You do too. Here, let's wander over to the other side. Okay, let's go. 25% all Chavez of all Chavez there. I don't see Chavez over here. I think they're over here, though. Did we show those yet? No. We've seen two Sharp Bite designs in the whole store. I like that one. It's mine. This is already. one of your favorite models. Yes. They're not cheap. No. That's one of our premium knives that we both uh, absolutely love. Love, yes. Okay, hinders. Mm-hmm. What else we <laughs> it's got? It's funny. It's like we just pass over hinder. I know people love them, but we just pass over them. Sorry, guys. I think I think I used to like them more. I know. That you want to look at? Right now. No, just uh, just looking. Uh huh. That okay. fixed blade yeah. is awesome. Look at that one. Oh yeah. That just catches my eye. Some of the brands, I gotta say, I'm not as familiar with. I know. Yeah. There's a lot of them over here, though. NSX. In in Snix. 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 We might take a look at one of those okay. um, in the future here. So, uh, yes. This year, yeah, yeah. We handled some at Blade Show, so yeah, yeah, we might need to check them out. This is Consignment Corner. We were just kind of laughing. Here's some of the consignment knives. I know, I like the CEO for 20 bucks. $20, how do yeah. you put a, a knife on consignment for $20 and in, here's 15. Nice, which one's Crawford. the cheapest? I'm trying to get a focus here. There's a $10 one back there. Oh wow. Nice. That's on consignment. Some CRKTs. <laughs> no, look at this over here though. Okay, this is the better stuff. Okay. The better stuff. Oh, Spider Co's, Microtex, there's some Medfords. Yep. What are some of the prices here? 400 Oh, there's Giant Mouse. Yeah, lots of Spider Co's. Yes. Some bench maids. That's the uh, the bailout. bailout. Yeah from SHOT Show 2023. I've got it. Okay, let's just say we've handled this one. This one has better action than ours does. <laughs> that particular knife has better action than mine. Yes, yes, okay. it does. Well, what and else we, we were got? talking to Eric from REC, yeah. and he was saying that this is actually more full than normal because people knew that the sale was going on. And that makes sense, yeah. So, might as well fill it while you can. Oh, there's a uh, Liang Ma. Which one is that? Um, that's the... I don't know. No, I can't read the name. Somebody else say it. It's my little one. It's my Cuff 2.0. Yeah, um, I think it's the Cuff 3, though. Oh, it is. Yeah, 3. Yeah, and yours yeah. is the... And there's Chavez, Emerson, more Benchmade. Mm -hmm. More consignment. They got a little bit of everything. They really do. I want to show everybody this though. Okay, go ahead. Where am I going? I don't know. Okay. All right. Look at that Norseman. Eight fifty. Seems like a good deal. Those are so nice. Yeah. Did we not own one of those? No, we handled Nick's. You handled a couple. Yeah. I'm surprised we never owned one. I know. They're Me not too. cheap. <laughs> yeah, lots more consignment. They have the Wii Knife, the Vision. It is, yeah. It's going for 225. 
They probably didn't like the clip placement. <laughs> that could be. Protex and hinders. The Sanzo is catching my eye for 50 bucks. Oh, the MKM? Uh -huh. Yeah. Which one? <laughs> Lots of different brands here. All right, Finch, QSP. There's some Wii knives, some of the Vision. Yeah. Lots of QSPs. Uh, Wesson. Yes, right? we've had those too. Yep. So this brand here, we've been getting some comments uh -huh. that, that we need to check them out. It's the Kunwu. They look interesting. They look nice. I like that little one, the Tao. You might guess that they are sourced from China. Possibly. They got some good looking knives. Okay, here's some penguins. And of course the otter is one of my favorites. Also the hawk. We're yes. talking QSP, yeah. What's down here? More of the Wii knives? Yeah. Oh, the Malice. Those are nice mm -hmm. button lock knives. Yeah, it's the Mini Mouse. Yeah. I like those a lot too. All right, along this wall, we have to take a look. They got they got whole shelves full of shaving cream. Yes, I mean, this is crazy. Shaving okay. cream, shaving soap. What's Coconut? this? Hey, wait, I want to smell this. Coconut shaving cream? Ooh. Here, let everybody get a whiff of that. It smells really good. Here, Here guys, go. smell yeah. Beard oil, pre-shave oil. Interesting, never, after shave balm. Never tried it. What's down here? There's aftershave. Okay, what does snake bite smell like is what I'm curious of. It doesn't have much of a smell. Interesting, okay. I don't know, some stuff you might not expect to find in a knife store, right? That is true, yeah. Oh, actual shaving razors. It says, try me. Really? <laughs> don't break me. Don't break me, try me. Is this how you do it? And then working our way down, they've got a whole section here for kitchen knives. Collections. Gustav. Nice. German, right? Yeah. And then the other part is Okay, these are cool. This is like the Kershaw budget line of kitchen knives, but I've always noticed that they're really neat looking. I, I don't know how great they are for $18.95, but they're really nice looking. Yeah, good stuff. Kitchen knives, we have a few. Not as many folders, uh, not as many as we do folders though, right? No, not nearly as many. We made our way up to the lounge, overlooking the whole store. What's this? There's all kinds of stuff. I see a honey badger, one of those Chavez. I like this. Is this custom work? Is that what it is? Maybe. I see one of your drawings. Wait a second, how did I get up here? Frankie's been testing pens. Yeah, this is really neat. I see a lot of stuff catching my eye here. I'm liking this and that. Upstairs, looking down on the on the store. You can see it's pretty busy. It's packed in here, and then there's more stuff outside. I'll do. I'll do that. Somebody bought him one of those from Amazon. Frankie's leaving one of her drawings up here. Here's a whole table of hinderer knives. Oh, I like it. Some of the SE fixed blades. We both love them. Yeah. We just haven't been into fixed blades as much lately. I know, we haven't as much. Well, we used to be 
into camping and outdoors and actually doing stuff. That makes us sound really lazy, though. They can search our videos. I we know, used to do I stuff. Know. But, I mean, we still use them here and there. What's your favorite? I still love the Azula. She's got that exact yeah. teal model there. You mean the green one? Isn't it teal? <laughs> no, green? it's lime okay. green. Lime green? All right. <laughs> I have that one. I have an ant one. And then I have, like, a bright red one. But I like, I like the threes, the fours. I like all of them. Yeah, three, four, five. I go for that orange five. Yeah. I like the neon green. Oh, there's the six up there. Yeah. And you see in the prices. They're not cheap, but they're probably our favorite fixed plates, honestly. They make some good stuff. They, I love their colors, mainly more than anything. Yeah, you always know it's an Essie. Yeah. We need this for the kitchen. Right here. This the, big old cleaver. The cleaver? Yeah. Frankie's checking out Bifrost Forge. I was looking at the stickers. That's for us. Yeah. Oh, it is us. For us. Are those oh. free? We're gonna have to grab one. It is Bird and Frankie. Aww. Look at they got wallets down here. Yes. We have those. I think that we do. A Ridge wallet? Yeah. We might. There's the tactile turn pins of which mine. you're carrying. Have we shown that? I don't know. I do have it on me though. She's Look. got, I got her this pin, right? As a gift, as a birthday gift. She's been carrying and using it. I have. Well, hold on, that, that's the brand down there. Yes. I like that little orange one too. And they're doing knives. We gotta start looking at their knives. We have. I gotta look at them more. Okay. A lot of different brands here. Okay, ZT. Frankie, they don't have that many. No, there's not really anything new from ZT though. No? There's the 452 CF. Yeah. That's still probably my favorite ZT or top one or two, Top I don't know. <laughs> uh, no, yeah, right. No, I love the 452. I know you do, yeah. Yeah. Well, what else do they got here? That giant mouse? There's a lot of giant mouses in here. There's the Clyde. Or, sorry, giant mice? Giant mice? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> the Corda? I really like that Sonoma, the all black. It's the blackout option. Yeah, with the uh, gold accents. That's really nice. I like that a it's lot. Elmax steel. Mm -hmm. All right, what do they got down here? There's Hogue knives. Hogue does a lot of OTFs. Yes. They've got their crossbar, uh -huh. the Deca. I love that. It's called the Able Lock. The what? Able. It's not Axis. No. It's Able. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I like that one, the fancy $320 version. Let me show everybody there. <laughs> I like it a lot. The one on the end. Yeah. It's three times the price of the other ones. The Riv. Mm hmm. The Rio, yeah, Naz like Nazca, Nazca. Uh huh. Oh, the Nimbus. Don't we have one of those? Yeah, we do. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I like them. They're fun. With giant mouse, you see Italy. You see China. Yeah. Is that their primary? Uh, those are the two. Yeah. Sources. Yeah. Oh, and then here's what they're doing today. Oh, what? Sorry. Oh, 15 percent off hose, 20 percent off giant mouse. Look for the green dots. Yeah. Only some of them are on sale. Well, all of those. Are, yeah. The raffle is over. I walked away for a second to go get pictures. Yes. And Frankie won something. I won this backpack. What is it? I don't know. Yeah, you know what is it's it? It's a vertex something. Vertex. Yes. But I'll use it as like a computer bag, I think. Might be good for a computer bag, huh? It has your trash in it. But yeah, I think my computer will fit in it. Tactical origami is what it says. Nice. It's tactigami. <laughs> Tech, that's what she goes with, yeah. We'll have to check this out at home. Maybe do it, I don't know, show it in its own video, but I know, it's she nice won this. Yeah. Did we have an idea of what they sell for? No, I think somebody told me it was like 120 bucks. Yeah. Well, she wanted as soon as I walked away. I know. I, 
it was lucky you being gone. I didn't win anything. No. We usually do that, honestly. Going on six o'clock. All right, the the uh, the show, the event. Yeah. Frankie ended at five. It did, yeah. There's still people in there. Everybody's gonna want to know what we got, what we're going home with. <laughs> it's funny what we have. Frankie wanted an M8 BMW M8 yes. wheel mm -hmm. because Ray Hall race cars are right, right there. there. I yeah. know. It's a beautiful wheel too. They actually share the same building. I know. That's crazy. Um, but that's what we're going home with. I know. It's weird. Whatever. All right. Anyway. It's beautiful. If they made it this far in the video, give us a thumbs up. Right? Yeah, Pretty check cool. it out. A little surprised we never made it here before. I know, right? But we have now. All right. Thanks a lot for joining us and make sure to subscribe. Bye. See ya. Never knew. Here, you can handle your really pretty knife right here. Oh, okay. Yes, yes, yes. This knife I said on video earlier, <laughs> um, it's the Stitch. Yeah. Yeah. This actual model, I'm saying, could be found at a gas station. You don't like it, I know. No, I just it just looks really cheap. It's the winter camo, though. Right. You can only carry it in the winter time. <laughs> Maybe if the blade itself was was black. Mm -hmm. um, I don't like it. I don't like that same coat all over the neck. Oh, it's the Arctic Camo, sorry. Arctic Camo? Is the name of it. Let me see. It's a nice knife, though. It really is. I don't mind the knife, the yeah. model. I just don't like this finish. I know. I know, I know. It's jimping on the, um, on the choil there. Yeah. It's nice. It's good in my hand. It is. It's a nice knife. Yeah. Yeah. Here, go ahead and okay, take I'll it. Okay, I'll take it. Yep. Yeah. I'll put it back in here. All right.